Hello viewers, we use this type of uh, Bluetooth headsets with our mobile phones. Do you know uh, we can use the same headset with our computer as a wireless Bluetooth headphone? Or you can talk using uh, this headset or you can use this one as a microphone as well. Today I am going to show you how you can use your Bluetooth headset with your computer when you have uh, Windows 7 installed on your computer. To do that, we will uh, need to turn on our Bluetooth device. Uh, this type of uh, buttons are available in some laptops. On some laptops, uh, you, you will find uh, control, uh, a system prayer icon. This will allow you to turn on or off your Bluetooth device like this this one is turned off if you put take this thing on again now this device is turned on now i'll double click on our system prayer icon when your device is a bluetooth device is active you will see this icon double click now you can see uh, there is uh, currently no uh, no device are available on our computer we will need to turn our uh, device headset device click and hold now it is green now it is blue blinking when it is blinking I'll go and click add device button and immediately you will see our headset is available and click on the next button now it's informing that configuring device. Whenever my device will be configured, uh, it will so show something different message. Now you can see uh, this device has been successfully added to this computer. I'll click on this close button. Now you can see my device is available in our control panel. I'll double click this uh, headset to get some more information now you can see our device is automatically connected with our uh, headset if you want to check some different settings you can click this button and you can see my hands-free device does not have a display and this is true my device does not have a display if you have a device with display you can check this thing on so that you can uh, control it from your headset as well I can disconnect by clicking on this button but I'm not going to do it right now uh, as this one is connected I'm going to show you how it uh, works I'll click this close button again the close button and uh, you can use Windows Media Player or some different third-party player I like Jet Audio most so I turn on my Jet Audio player whenever uh, you will play now you will uh, listen that the music is uh, coming from this headset now I cannot uh, show you because this one is playing inside this uh, headset and this is very uh, small volume and uh, whenever you will click uh, this play button it will work but now you can see this one is not working while I'm clicking this uh, play and pause because the first time when you install this device it may work or it may not work if it works then this is good but if it does not work then restart your computer like this start click on this one and restart now my PC uh, will, will be restarted and my device will be start working uh, it may take some time uh, to restart my PC so I'm going to pause the video and whenever my PC is back then I'll uh, uh, show you again now after getting restarted my computer is back so I'm going to show you how uh, my remote control is working of my Bluetooth headset I turn on my player again and whenever I will click on this uh, play button and as you can see it is immediately start getting uh, played started playing I'll show you again now uh, while I click this next button
maybe I will turn on this way so that it will be visible I click next, next button now you can see the video is getting changed on my laptop same way next track maybe this one you can see if I click this pause button and uh, it is getting paused as you can see again I can resume like this I can uh, use this uh, Bluetooth headset as a remote control as we can enjoy our music from our uh, this wireless device I hope uh, you enjoyed watching this video I hope I'll come with some new videos uh, and uh, new tutorials on the next videos thank you for watching this video